chose engineering chemistry because I really loved chemistry in high school. I loved that one chemical could make another chemical and all the theory behind it. If you have a very strong interest in chemistry and uh, you have done well in your studies, then you should look at engineering chemistry. It's a heavy program. You'll be taking lots of extra applied chemistry with some of the honors chemistry students as well. I have a degree in engineering when I graduate, but I'm also certified as a chemist. So I think that that's a major plus, and really it opens up doors in both chemistry and chemical engineering after graduation. The engineering chemistry students, because of the dual accreditation, have a little heavier workload, but they are a very um, uh, cohesive group, being a little bit smaller. One of the courses in second year that you take is, is called thermodynamics. And what this involves is uh, a design project. And the design project is almost a derivative of an, of an actual real life example. So professors uh, try to, to give you that, that sense of industry while you're in class. In engineering chemistry, because it's such a small group of people who are taking all the same courses, um, you really get to know the other people in it. Everyone's working together towards a common goal. Just to give you a feel for the class sizes that we have here at Queen's, uh, the engineering chemistry classes are about, about 35 students. I was really astonished, especially in second semester, how open and available the professors were to help, especially with design projects, and an extra help whenever you needed it. Almost all of our academic staff have won awards for their teaching and their research too as well. Uh, in the fourth year thesis, what you do is uh, spend some time in the lab, get the results. Uh, there's a poster session at Christmas where you have a chance to present your interim results. And then at the end of the year, you have a presentation and a report that's actually handed in. Courses are sometimes taught in here where profs can rent out the room and teach on a projector in front of everyone that has a computer in front of them. There's also some leather couches over in the corner that you can sit and study at, and it really makes a great place for um, people who are in chemistry to come out and work together on big projects. Uh, it really provides a solid background so that uh, it can really be flexible after it was in your career choice. Some of the career options that you get with engineering chemistry degree is you're more of the middleman. Um, most companies will hire chemical engineers and chemists and they'll have to pick an engineering chemist for the middle to go back and forth between the two. Um, so they know everything that's going on on the chemical side and everything that's going on on the process side. So if you have a strong interest in chemistry and if you think you'd like to work more at the molecular level, the molecular design level, in trying to develop new compounds, new products that way, then engineering chemistry might be the program for you. Um, it really combines the chemistry and the process side of both chemical engineering and chemistry and really makes a unique blend. So Queen's engineering chemists are really one of a kind.